Lily, can you say Subaru? Subaru. What's happening? Well, as the title said, I made a mistake. Um, I was driving along the other day, my phone was ringing, doing something, I was not paying attention, I looked down at it, ran right into a guy. Um, just a stupid mistake. I mean, honestly, I haven't wrecked, really wrecked, like, into another, like, major thing. I don't think I've ever hit another car. This is the first time. Um... The other time I wrecked really bad, I rolled my Jeep Wrangler like onto its roof when I was in high school. But this is like the first time I've actually wrecked. Like I've had my Camaro, my Trailblazer, no no issues. Other than people hit me and I've had some work done. But let me show you here what's going on. It's like the middle of January here in Ohio and it's so warm out. It's crazy. But um, let me show you here. Okay, so as I was saying, this part right here, this front fender, I kind of like the guy was pulling into the straight lane and I was going to the turning lane. He stopped and I didn't expect him to stop and I didn't realize I was even running into him until my mirror actually hit his rear taillight. It was like a, either a Dodge Nitro or a Jeep Cherokee or a Liberty, those boxy ones. But all this was done by the corner of his back bumper. So all he had was a scratch on his bumper. And then, of course, I just wasn't even still paying attention and got this little bit back here. So all said and done, I have progressive for insurance. I um, have to pay my deductible, of course. But, uh, I, you know, their estimate, $2,000 to do this new fender, paint, um, blending in the paint back there. It's... I don't know, it's such a bummer because this car is like this close to being perfect and then you go and do something like this. So, I don't know. It's, it's really clean right now because I'm trying to drop it off real clean because it's a clean car even though it's the middle of winter. If that makes sense, they always say if you take your car to get work done, people are going to respect it more if it's clean when you give it to them. So it's pretty darn good right now, not too bad. I did not hit the winter wheels though. Those managed to survive unscathed, and I mean, it's just a perfect, his bumper was right there, and due to the flared out wheel wells, didn't hit either of the doors, so that's good, not really any issues there, so they're going to change out this fender, um, and paint it, and do this and that, probably about a week of work. In all honesty, um, you can comment how you want, it was a stupid mistake, I, I kind of feel stupid for doing it, I mean, once again, I mean, two miles an hour nobody got hurt nobody was injured that's what everybody says you know the most important thing but man it's so such a bummer but either way it's got to get fixed because it just looks like crap right now so uh i will keep you updated kind of show you the uh, the finished product and i actually have some some parts to put on this car but this kind of put a delay on it but um so i'll get kind of back on track here soon with the subaru so um until then, I'm driving a 96 Blazer on loan from my dad, so going to be riding in style for sure. So see you next time. Uh, more stuff coming soon. Rubber City Motoring. See ya.